New at six, Animal Care Services says it's one of the worst cases of animal cruelty they have ever seen. An eight-year-old poodle brought to ACS now dead after attempts to stabilize her failed. As Bill Barajas explains, ACS now wants your help tracking down the person responsible for that neglect. And we warn you, the images you're about to see could disturb some of you. Visibly weak and in pain, Hope was barely able to move as veterinarians did what they could. It was a race against time, one ACS says they see all too often. We've seen, um, unfortunately, um, other cases where they are, um, they have severe mats um, around, you know, around their body and around their limbs. Uh, we've had cases where uh, the matting has constricted uh, blood flow of the limbs and have resulted, unfortunately, in amputations. But for her, she's she's probably one of our, our most severe cases that we've had. Hope, an eight-year-old poodle, was brought in by a good Samaritan. She was found in an alley on the 5800 block of Babcock. She's very cold. Um, currently, she appears to be jaundiced, um, so it looks like she has not been eating for quite some time um, and may have just been left in that in that alleyway um, for, for a while. The eight-year-old poodle was severely matted. The matted area even had mold. Almost two pounds of mats that's on the dog. Um, she is spayed, so likely she has an owner. At the time we visited, ACS staff was hopeful she would pull through. Their plans were to stabilize her, rehabilitate her, and find her a home. Hope, unfortunately, did not make it. The staff caring for her did their best to make her comfortable during her final few hours. If you have any information on what happened to Hope or who she may belong to, you're asked to call 311. ACS investigators will take it from there. In downtown Bill Barajas, KSAT 12 News.